Fellas, 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 what is going on today, fellas? So in this video, I'm going to give you some snipe filters for the new Prime Series 3 Kawhi Leonard packs. So these are the new players that we got. We got five opals in these packs. Uh, this is ridiculous. George Gervin, Kawhi Leonard, Gary Payton, Pascal, and Joel Embiid. But just because there's five opals does not mean that all of these guys are snipes. The only, As of right now, the Gary Payton and the George Gervin, they're not... I mean, they're, they're buy nows. You can snipe them, but they're but they're buy nows. So you, get, you guys get what I'm saying. We also got David Robinson and Tony Parker. So I'm going to tell you some snipe filters for all of these guys and what you want to do to make a lot of MT. So let's just get straight into it. Also, I've had the luxury of... Actually, I just did a million MT pack opening on stream just before this video. If you guys didn't see that, the, the stream will be public if you want to go back and watch. I pulled six opals, guys. Six of them in one million MT, okay? So yeah. Uh, but let's get into the filters, man. So obviously the first one uh, the, in the filter that I'm probably going to spend a lot of time on today is you just go Galaxy Opal. You're going to go, I mean, yeah, you're going to go Prime Series 3. I mean, there, there's multiple filters you can do, guys. There's multiple, but we're going to go Prime Series 3 and we're going to go Minimum Bio 500. And I'll show you the players that are on this filter. So we've got uh, Luca, and we have Lamar Odom. Sorry for the notifications. And we got Paul George. Wait, hold on. Wait, hold up. Yeah, Luca, Lamar Odom, Paul George, and then, and then Kawhi. So, it's ridiculous, bro. Anything that you see on this filter is a snipe, bro. Even a Luca, even a Luca goes for a lot. I mean, look at look at his price. What is he ending at? This one is a diamond shoe contract over 300k. So he's really ending at a lot right now. And I'm actually intrigued to see how much he ends for. I might, I have one in my auctions. I might have to sell that man. But yeah, that's one filter you can do um and i'll give you another one so what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to filter out larry if you guys have a lot of mt like me what you can do is you can just buy him and then you can filter out larry but you don't want to just leave it on small forward because it's uh it's not going to be good because there's other small forwards that are buy nows as well so what you do is you're going to go conference you're going to go west and then at that point it'll filter out the other guys and then all you really have to filter out is larry from uh if i'm not mistaken i'm pretty sure the only guy you have to filter out is larry you don't have to worry about stephen jackson or Danny Granger. Danny Granger sometimes pops up on the East. And yeah, you don't have to worry about that because, uh, you know, Larry's the only one. So if Larry was not on the Spurs, then it would be better. But unfortunately, he is on the Spurs, so it's kind of tough. Yeah. So another filter you can use is Galaxy Opal. And you can go Prime VIP uh, Series 3. So now that they're dropping, they dropped a ton of Opals. The Prime VIP sets, they have a ton of Opals in them. So what you want to do is you have you have a couple options here with this filter you can sit on this filter and filter out all of the buy now guys so we got what trey young um victor oladipo there's uh obviously there's george gervin is gary payton and i think that my oh danny granger sometimes danny granger is a buy now sometimes he's not let's let's see let's see what he's ending at but this is an option for you to do this let's hold on, let's just check danny granger all right yeah danny granger you can filter him out as well and after you filter out those guys then you're gonna see basically for the most part anyone who's a snipe so let me just check sean kemp to see if he is and i'll tell you exactly all of the players that you can snipe on this filter because it, it's actually not a bad one all right sean kemp is not a buy now let's check his price though because just because he's not a buy now doesn't mean he's necessarily a snipe all right, yeah, Sean Kemp, at this moment of time that I'm recording this, 12.47 p.m., he will give you profit if you do snipe him. So it might be worth it to actually get him. So I'll tell you all the players you can see on this filter. And boom, the ones that are snipes, at least that are going to give you profit, Sean Kemp, KP, um, Joel Embiid, who, we, who else we got? Um, bro, who's the other guy in the packs, bro? Who's the other guy in the packs? Oh, Pascal. Pascal is going to give you profit too. As of right now, Pascal will give you profit. It's five players. That's what I was thinking of. And I think that might be it. So if you filter out Victor Oladipo, if you filter out um, Danny Granger, filter out Trey Young, you filter out... Is there anyone else? I think that might be it. Those, those few guys. Uh, oh, no, no, no. Also, George Gervin and Gary Payton, filter out those guys. Then, you know, you can use this filter. But it is going to cost a lot to do that. So... You know, if you have a lot of MT, why not, you know? But also, if you don't want to filter out anybody, if you don't have the MT to do that, you can just do this. If you find the cheapest one, so Galaxy Opal Prime Series 3, you find the, the, the cheapest player on this filter. And you can snipe with this filter. 
I, I low-key think this filter would be good. It might be a little inconsistent at times, but I feel like you can actually get some really good snipes on this filter. Whoa, whoa, what am I doing? I just went to free agent. You want to find the cheapest, which is probably going to be like a Victor Oladipo or Trey Young for around our 65K. Um, Victor Oladipo, that might be a little bit of a snipe. Let me increase that a little bit. Okay, no. Victor Oladipo, 65K. He's the cheapest Prime Series 3 player. So what you do is you set your max buyout to, I would say, you can set it to around 55. 10K cheaper is typically, you know, a good option. Let me see. If you if you buy Victor Oladipo for 55K, some for 65, then take off 6,500. So yeah, you can set it to 55K and the minimum profit you make off of Victor Oladipo snipe would be, you know, a few thousand MT. So, you know, this is a good way to set it. And boom, Galaxy Opal Prime Series, VIP Series 3, maximum buyout at, at 55K. You can see all of the Prime Series 3 players and you don't have to filter out anybody. The only thing is it's not going to be as consistent as if you were to filter out the other guys with the enabled because, um, you know, obviously the max buyout is cheaper. So, you know, that, that, that's an option that you can do if you want to. Okay, that's up to you if you guys want to do this or not. But this is a filter that is probably probably going to become a little bit better in the future as they continue to drop Prime. I mean, there's only one more player, I think, until the lock-in. But it's going to get a little bit better once they drop those new packs, which I don't know when that'll be but let's show you another filter and it's essentially it's the same concept but you just change the color to pink diamond and then you you're, you're gonna lower the buyout and you want to find the cheapest pink diamond so they're actually going for pretty cheap and basically ideally you'd be searching for david robinson on this filter but anybody else in this set can pop up as well so let's drop this down uh 11k seems to be a joe caldwell this is actually a really good card 10k 10.5 10.2 10 yeah joe oh he's nine thousand eight thousand all right yeah joe colwell is cheap cheap so he's he's around eight thousand eight hundred mt so what you can do you can set your max buyout to like 7k if you get a joe coldwell for 7k you sell him at like 8.7 or whatever they're gonna take off 870 so you'll make like i don't know 130 mt profit but that's only off, off of a joe caldwell if you really want to filter out joe caldwell and then bump the max buyout even further then you can do that but Otherwise, you can just set it to 7K right here and Pink Diamond Prime VIP Series 3. Uh, and then like this, bro, just continue refreshing like that, 7K. And you can get any of the Pink Diamond Prime VIP Series 3 players. Let me just show you who those are so you guys get an idea of who you can actually snipe. Uh, Eddie Curry, if you get that lucky. Joe Caldwell, Miles Turner, obviously the new David Robinson, George Marison, Dino Raja. Like there, there's quite a few players on this filter and maybe some more that may not be popping up. This might be it though. I can't really remember all of them off the top of my head, but yeah. And lastly, I'll show you like a, a nice little diamond filter that is exactly basically the same, but instead you're just going to drop the max bio even further because this one's going to be for Tony Parker. But if you're going to do this, like you really might as well just do the regular diamond filter. So, but you can do this if you want to, the, this diamond filter right here, but you know, you look at that. I just missed a Tony Parker for 500, bro. Just trying to check his price. Literally just trying to check his price, bro. That's crazy. But essentially what you do is you find the cheapest diamond from the prime. Is this the same one? I think that's the same one. Uh, let's see. Bro, why is this Tony Parker keep popping up? Let's see. Let's see. Bro, that Tony Parker stays popping up. That stuff is old, old. All right. So the, the cheapest Tony Parker is like 2000 mt so you can drop the max buyout too but look at that tony parker is still popping up bro that's weird but you can drop the max buyout to like i don't know 12 13 around there and if you sell it for 2000 they'll take off 200 you can set it to like maybe 14 prime diamond prime vip series 3 1400 max buyout and then you just keep refreshing i don't know for whatever reason that that tony parker isn't um going away let me see if i put the max bin and i refresh it will it go away let me see let me see if i decrease this will it go away yeah it's glitched bro i don't know why it's doing that but you know that's uh that's the filter you don't need the max bid there for whatever reason that tony parker's glitched so but other than that that's how you set up the filters those are the filters i have for you guys today um if they were helpful uh, you know, make sure to hit the like button. Make sure to subscribe. Let me know what you guys get in the comments. We're on the road to 30k, guys. So I hope you guys, if you're new, to hit the subscribe button and like the video as well. And yeah, with that said, oh, I stream every day at 5 p.m. Eastern, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.